right, this is what I believe to be a 1982 or 83 Kawasaki 250. I can't think it's a prairie, that's what they call them. Utility, it's not really the trail type, but uh, it's got the front suspension, it's nice. No rear suspension, uh, five speed uh, manual, not semi auto, manual, clutch on the handlebar in there. Brakes work, they're okay. Um, yeah, I mean, it's pretty decent shape. Runs. Uh, when I got it, it, didn't have any spark, so it ended up being a CDI, which I replaced. Um, doesn't seem to smoke at all. So, runs good. So, previous owner must have spray painted it. I think it used to be a green color like the handlebars, but I mean, it's complete. It's got the uh, uh, toolbox and all the racks. And the seat's been re reupholstered, which is really nice. You can tell it is because it doesn't say Cowie on it. I'm sure it said originally. All oh, this seems to be original. I mean, the handle it's not really that rusty or anything. It probably could easily be cleaned up. It's still pretty with dirt but lights work uh suspension is pretty good I, I don't know if the shocks work necessarily but uh i was uh driving this thing in the ditch and it was doing just fine so i think it's just old and probably needs some small stuff uh, it does have an oil leak while it's running okay down there not sure what the deal with that is but I did convert it from the mechanical fuel pump to electric, the clicky clacker. Not ideal, but the uh, boot on the intake was junk when I got it. Uh, I haven't replaced it, but I do have another one for it. So the vacuum line wasn't working. And I'm not sure if the original fuel pump even works on it. But the uh, this one works just fine. You just put the key in the on position, it turns on, it runs just fine. Drove it probably 20, 30 miles like that. Doesn't seem to have any issue with it. Yeah, I don't know what else to say on it. Uh, obviously, it runs just fine, idles, and drive it around. I just have no use for the thing. Go up north, you know, you're going riding in the really rocky trails of northern Minnesota or whatever it is, and it just, it's not what you're going to do with this, but, you know sitting there banging around you're gonna crash it's not even it's not even a question of if it's just a when and uh, it's all rocks so I'd rather not do that so need a four-wheeler got one I'd rather use that than this so as much as I like it it's pretty neat little trike I guess it'd be called um looks like a try going here without throttle That does work. I don't know why it's missing the cover, but yeah, it is what it is. It does work. Yeah, I don't know what to say on it. Um, it's a decent little running three wheeler. So looks like it was stored inside most of its life. It's not all rusty and stuff. I mean, there's a little bit starting there, but for 40 years old, you know, it's not not really that bad. I did. The tires are all in really good shape too. The front one is definitely near or if not new. The rears, you know, they have, still have a little bit, but they've obviously been ridden on a little bit. That side was low, and it seems to go low after a long time riding. Uh, this one, I haven't had to air up at all. Same with the front 
one, so should uh, should be just fine for a long time. Figure out that oil leak's kind of annoying. I have a feeling it's just that plate cover. Kind of is what it is. I don't really want to mess with it, but it runs good. So. Don't I don't have much experience with three wheelers other than uh, I think it was a Honda 185 or something a long time ago. Gotta say, the suspension really helps. I crashed the other one so many times in the ditch, you know, got the washboards. This one, I went over the washboards, it was just fine. Even without the rear suspension, it just doesn't, you know, the front's what matters. And really did help a lot having that on there, so. I don't know, they're not really a trail machine. I mean, they're obviously utility with all the racks and all that it has on it. But it's really not too bad of a design. Personally, I really do appreciate Cowie. They're a good brand overall. I like their jet skis and haven't had really any experience with their four wheelers necessarily. I've heard ups and downs on those, but obviously motorcycles and all that are really, really good. So, yeah, if you have any questions, I mean, I doubt I'll be able to answer it, but uh, you throw them in the comments. Otherwise, have a good one.